Won't you spare me over till another
Hello. 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 What the fuck was that? That's so weird. <laughs> That's so weird. I think that was from the tab. Yeah, from the mod view tab. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> Hello friends, welcome in. <clears throat> that was from the mod view tab. For some reason it wasn't muted. Hello, hello. Friday, the weekend. We'll come in. The fuck is Deja Flu? In the top right corner. <clears throat> so, today <clears throat> we have another game, sort of like Detroit Become Human. It's, um,. It's basically a choice-based game, narrative, you know. Uh, these people, Supermassive Games, pretty great studio. They've made Until Dawn. I don't know if you guys have heard of Until Dawn. Well, they have made Until Dawn. So, hello, young. Welcome in, brother. Uh, they've made Until Dawn, and they've made an anthology called The Dark Pictures Anthology. The first one among of these anthology is Man of Medan, which is the game we're playing here today. <clears throat> A Man of Medan. It's the first one of the anthology. And I heard that it's good, so I always like to uh, play choice-based games. Download CS2, I already did. I already did. Well, if you talk, I would join you, but you didn't talk. But anyways, that's not the point. The point is when I downloaded it, I saw that there's no short matches, so I was like, no, I don't have time for this. Hello, motherfucker. I don't have time for this right now, so I went to CSGO. Hello, MC, welcome in, brother. Welcome in, thank you, thank you. Hello, motherfucker, to you. So, <clears throat> what I did, it's like Valorant, that's great, that's great news. 24 rounds first, ah, you meant like Valorant in terms of rounds. Um, so yeah, when I saw it's like a long game, I was like, I don't think I have the time to test it right now. So I went for short games instead in CSGO. Played two, um, two games, ranked top fragged in both, and ranked up. GG easy. <laughs> GG easy. Hello MC, how are you brother? Oh, Jero, is she? It's been like that for a week. It's been like that for more than a week, I think. It's been like that for more than a week. Yeah, take it off you brother, thank you. Play alone. Well, yeah, we're playing alone. So yeah, that's what happened. Maybe I'll play after. After the stream, we'll see. Chinese market, I played with Santa for like six hours. Jesus. You guys are relentless, taking a break till 12 or so. You guys are relentless. You ain't even watching anime now, Oh, Say hi to Lulu. Uh, new story, new slot. Zahten, what are you eating? What is my boy having? It's really cool, not gonna lie. Oof. Burgers! Sahten, sahten. I wanna have burgers. I miss Chimkin burger burgers. Nice, sahten. I love the fact that you guys are eating now at 10.35 p.m. Meanwhile, if I tell Fobstress, let's eat like at 9 or 8.30, and I say burgers, and they're like, no, this is too late for me. <laughs> Can we switch places? <laughs> the ladies can live together, the men would live together. How about that? <clears throat> the land of the free. So... Let's see what the story is about. It's just, apparently we're in China, right? Yeah, they said China, Chinese market or something. Buster, we better mosey on back to the ship. Mosey. Ted Mosby. Whoa. Stop the presses. What? Looks like a graphics Charlie look weird a bit. To attend to. Can I fight? Hey, oh, you know Chinese, nice. Give me a quarter. The graphics look worse than their older game until dawn. That's weird. 
She looks Let's like the it. kid from The Grudge. What's in store for me, Pop? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Three days, yeah. <laughs> I remember that kid. Yo, even ma. Have you got any questions to ask the tiles? Say nothing curious. Tell me about my son. Dubious. Will I be rich? How can I choose? Ah, with the right. Never mind. I'm just selecting the left. Uh, I guess I Tell me about my son. About my son? Will he, I've watched uh, this game before. Oh, you've done. Is he gonna it's nice. Right? Things gonna That's work great. Out for him? I, I played Until Dawn. I liked it a lot. So I'm curious to see what the, the other similar type games that they make. Bamboo tile, dragon tile, choose. I will choose the dragon tile. I feel like most people will choose the dragon tile. Look at the tile. Those games are nice for me. Same. I love them. I love them. Tell me what you see. Hold on to pick up objects, try to examine. So might be biased. No, I love them as well, so... Uh, I love them as well, so your biasing works for me as well. Because I'm biased to them as well. Like... I don't think there is a choice-based game out there that I did not play yet, except for these, the Dark Pictures Anthology. Your fortune... Until Dawn is still peak for me. No, I love Until Dawn, but would you rate it higher than Detroit, really? The quarry map is not on par to it. I haven't played the quarry yet, I want to play it. Uh, have you? Do you think it's better than Detroit? And you should try... It's an old game. It's a very old game. I would I would probably play it on stream even. It's made by Quantic Dream. Ah, okay, fair. Uh, Indigo Prophecy. It's called Indigo Prophecy or Fahrenheit. Fahrenheit, yeah. Two names. I don't know why there's a name for the European market and the American market. Don't ask me. It's the original Quantic Dream game made like by the same studio of Heavy Rain and uh, Beyond Two Souls and, and Detroit. Fahrenheit. Amazing game, I agree. I think I butchered it. <laughs> no, I think you wrote it correctly. I think this is how you write Fahrenheit. Yeah. It's amazing. Really amazing. <clears throat> Death. Death. Wait, what? What does that mean? Hey, what does that mean? What the hell, man? I mean, you asked for your fortune, right? Insecure, altruistic, reckless, selfish, eager, guarded. Okay, this is interesting. Usually they don't have stuff like this. I'm controlling his face, by the way. I love Beyond Two Souls. Everyone I ask them about it says it's shit. <laughs> yep. It's not, I wouldn't say it's shit. But it's not as good as the others. It's, it's okay. It's okay. Joe. Secrets. Oof, many secrets. Bearings. Pictures, nothing. They changed the name of North for North America to avoid confusion with Fahrenheit 9-11, a popular and controversial movie at the time, a few years after 9-11. Oh, thank you, Dr. Wu. Welcome in. See, always can rely on Dr. Wu to bring in the knowledge and the sarcasm. This is knowledge, not sarcasm. Howdy. Howdy. <clears throat> Doctor is a doctor. Hey, bud, let me get a go at it. Did you play it in equal proportion? I agreed. Can you play with your friend? Fight? Oh sure. shit! The way she was like. Let me another quarter. Gonna start a tab. I'll give it a whirl. Whirl. Oh, this is for fighting. I see. Nice game. This is aimbot, bro. I'm improving my aim for Cisco. The time shows how much time you have left. Improving my aim for Cisco or CS2, sorry. Okay. We're getting some QTEs. First you said you could fight. What do you mean? I thought you said you could fight. I'm literally acing everything. I'm literally acing everything. Here. What do you want from me? You're even increasing the speed of the things, and I'm still doing well. What do you want? I wonder if they're gonna keep increasing it until uh, they find the difficulty for you in the game. Yeah, looks like I'm the karate master now. 
Wouldn't you know it? I think I'm supposed to fail them if I want to make the game easier. Hey, Chuck, I don't know if it's related or not. We don't want to get stranded. Because some games, you know, they do that. Really some games do that where they make you play a certain section just to see how well you do, and depending on that, they give you the difficulty of the game. They haven't asked me here, but yeah. I love the start of Fahrenheit, but the longer it went, the more I disconnected with the story. Oof. Okay, yeah, I know what you mean. I know what you mean. I know what you mean. I didn't disconnect from the story, but I know why you. some people would. Because it goes crazy at the end. It goes batshit crazy. It starts as a murder mystery kind of scenario, and then it goes full on batshit crazy at the end. I liked it from start to finish. I liked it from start to finish, not gonna lie, I liked it from start to finish, but yeah, I can see why, I can see why. <laughs> but it was definitely more grounded in reality at the beginning. And then it just gradually started to unravel the plot of the mystery and the exotic things that lie in store for you. <laughs> I know what you mean. Hey, where's my... Where's my 50 cents? 50 cents? Well, was, was the rapper a thing back then in Vietnam? I don't think he was. I don't think he was. Bro, holy shit. What the fuck is going on? This is loud. Is that loud for you guys? Was that loud for you guys? Let me know, please, if that's very loud. A little bit. Yeah. Okay. And also let me know if it's too loud for the mic as well. Uh, we fucked around with the settings yesterday because of the uh, to the moon. Wait a minute. I think I originally, yep, I originally raised it too much. It's still too loud. What the fuck? Since when are games this loud? Better? Is that better? Let me know. Let me know if that sounds better. I'm gonna even decrease the mic volume a bit because I feel like my mic is a bit high as well. Selfish, insecure, reckless, altruistic. Isn't altruistic the opposite of selfish? I remember altruistic being the opposite of selfish. It is. So how come I have both? Altruistic and selfish. How come I have both? What's inside the box? What's in the box? Sounds like deadly poison or something. Did you play these, Dr. Wu? Did you play the Dark Pictures or Until Dawn or anything by Supermassive, basically? I've only played Until Dawn. I want to play everything else. Because Until Dawn was really cool. Is that gas? Hmm. Played until dawn and seen playthroughs for of the quarry. Is the quarry any good? Nothing from the dark pictures. Cool. It's a first for all of us here then. Except for young. Young played this. Uh, watch this. Quarry is okay, not as good until dawn. So I hear. So I hear. So I hear. Joe Sickbay. Is it just me, or does the, the graphics in this game seem not as good as Until Dawn? Even though Until Dawn came out way earlier than this one. Pops, come back soon. It has a, we have a son? I don't agree with that. Mm -hmm. We have a son? 
Okay, pressing the L1 button, R1 button, makes you enter the menu options. What the fuck? What the hell indeed? Jesus. Although until dawn looks incredible for its time. It does. It really does. Are those pennies? Yeah, let's inspect the key. What, what could be behind the key? <laughs> I want to <laughs> Someone who likes these types of games, you should definitely play the quarry. I definitely want to play the quarry. Is it on PC yet? Or was it not released on PC? I don't remember if it was a PlayStation exclusive or not. It's on Steam. Perfect. Perfect. Why can't I do something with the body? Hold on, was the only PS4, PS5, I know, yeah. And still is. And sadly, still is. Fucking Sony, man. Like, all we want is Bloodborne and... Until dawn. That's all that's left. Don't give me The Last of Us. I don't care about The Last of Us. Plus, it's, it was very bad. The, the PC port was very bad. I don't mean the game is very bad. The PC port was very bad. The game is good. I'd, I'd consider playing it. Do you think there's anything on the right side? Nope, nothing there. Kept pressing the wrong button. This is reminding me a lot of the old school Resident Evil games. You know, those uh, cameras. Ghost of Tsushima would be sweet too. Ghost of Tsushima is an amazing game. Let me tell you something about GOAT or Ghost of Tsushima. Ghost of Tsushima is the first game for me to platinum because I just enjoyed doing it so much. I usually never platinum any game because I find it like not interesting. Find it not interesting at all to do that because it's usually like, oh, collect all of these things or do 10 flips or what you know it's not stuff that are interesting to me i know some people might love that but not me ghost of tsushima was the first game where i was like no i'm having so much fun i want more i want more of this game so i kept playing and playing and i was like and then it was like all of a sudden just you know finishing the platinum trophy because i was collecting everything on the map because i was having fun you know especially when i like i even turned out turned up the difficulty to the highest one was which was like one hit kill the highest difficulty was one hit kill it was so fun i still was having a lot of fun so yeah that's the that's ghost of tsushima for me it's such a great game i'd have done the bamboo strikes even if there was no reward i know right i know right i know right like the mini games the all of those mini games they were so fun except for the poem one the right the poem not poem haiku the haiku writing one was a bit weird but <laughs> hey no complaints what the hell's going on up there heard aircraft and gunfire me too and there bro was, uh, charlie looks weird of course what in the sick bay something's wrong let's get out of here <laughs> charlie's character looks so weird as you haikus were nice they did wear out they're welcome DLC was pretty excellent too. I did not play the DLC. I heard it. Are you talking about the multiplayer or something else? Why is there so many, so much blood here? Did he kill him? Are you talking about the multiplayer aspect or was there like single player stuff as well? Single player DLC, Iki Island, I think it was. Oh, I. I don't know anything about that. And that private Charles Anderson on leave from duty did display intoxication in a manner not becoming a member of the US Army. Private Anderson was engaging with another soldier in a drunken argument. It is the opinion of the arresting officer that this would lead to a public brawl, and steps were taken to ensure that both men were returned to their ship. Brig 10 days approved. Brig is usually prison, right? If I remember correctly, that's jargon for prison, like military kind of prison. Brig. You traveled to a remote island where your father had butchered the people and they hated your family. Ooh, interesting. That's a very interesting premise, especially considering the ending. It's 
it's kind of follows some of the same path the main story did, but the gameplay additions and final payoff were worth it. Oof. I hope they released on PC then. I'll definitely play it. I'll definitely play it. I don't know if I still have my save file for the Saturday. Charles Anderson, private, public intoxication, brawling, 10 days. Same thing, I guess. Yep, same thing. I don't know if I still have my save file on PS. <clears throat> Like if it gets uploaded to your account or not, I have no idea how safe safe files work if there's a cloud system or not in place. Let's say in time with the heartbeat, okay. I just randomly press A. Wait, I don't get it. Like just press A. Oh, that's it. How about you attack him and take the gun from him? I guess not. I'm going to turn around at some point. Should have, should have just attacked him and took his gun from him, in my opinion. But okay. The, the camera angles and the way the hallways are set up—it's reminding me a lot of uh, what was that? of Resident Evil, the old Resident Evil games. I think the smoke is like some kind of hallucinogen, and it's making us see things that are not there. And everyone's going batshit crazy as a result. I hope this is not the path. Is it the path? Might be the main path, actually. I'm gonna check what's over here. Yep, that was the main path. Why are the characters so, like, mind fucked? <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, the characters are so like out of it. Like, it's what's going on? What's going on? Charlie, help. To be fair, what is going on? But like, still, mouth breathing kind of scenario, you know? Is that the now. same guy? You said it. Fubar and then son. Fubar? I don't remember what Fubar meant. <laughs> I don't remember what Fubar meant. More army jargon. Fucked up beyond all recognition. <laughs> yep. Yeah, I think I heard it from from boxing or UFC terminology. Jesus. Jesus. Nope, not the way forward. My guy went full Undertaker, man. He's like, he's gone. Full Undertaker. I'm, I'm pretty sure this is just a tutorial, right? This is just a tutorial. These guys are dead. My character is dead. There's no way my character lives. All they'll be to walk faster. Finally! Jesus! I've been waiting for this button forever. This is just a tutorial. I'm pretty sure this character is gonna die soon. Glad you have Doctor to fill my typical place for the time being. Hello, Momo. How are you going? Yeah, Doctor is an amazing man, isn't he? Or person. We love the Doc. And we were interacting a lot during BG3 as well. Sadly, I had to stop BG3 for now, but not forever. I will return to BG3 on stream, I promise you. Let's just see how Starfield goes, and then we'll see. Hello? No one could fill Moe's place, least of all me. 
You mean you can't be right all the time like him? Yeah, of course, no one. Of course, no one can be as right all the time as Mo. I have my missing BG3 then. Mm hmm, mm hmm. There's gonna be Starfield soon, and then after Starfield, we'll see what happens. Cyberpunk or BG3? BG3 or Cyberpunk? Well, what the hell are those faces? Streams, I mean. Yeah, I know, I know what you meant. I know what you meant. I know you're not missing the BG3 streams, I know. A BG3 last night, actually. Ooh! What did you think? What did you think? I thought you'd beat it earlier after what you told me with Act 2. Like, the way you finished, the speed at which you finished Act 2 was insane. I thought maybe you... You beat Act 3 even faster. Act 1 was my favorite by far. Oh, shit. The one I'm in right now. Why is it, though? Why is it? Act 2 took me about 20 hours. Act 3 took me... Th what? Really? I swear, I could have swore, man. Act 1 was 50. Yeah, Act 1 was long. I could have swore I heard a lot of people say that Act 3 is the shortest and Act 2 is the longest. Like a lot of reviewers or stuff. Man of Banana is very disappointing, by the way. Oh? How so? Oh god, no. Charlie! I think you're right, you must have killed the characters who have Act 2 story. Oh, okay. Are you talking about companions or like NPCs? From the reviews, both. Oh, shit, but you're a murderous person, aren't you? <laughs> you kind of already figured out the plot five minutes and That's the plot. I mean, I thought that was... Based on the fact that there's the smoke and it makes you see things. And now we turn as well into one of those. According to the reviews I saw, Man of Medan had the best scores in comparison to the rest. Like, they're all very close. I think Man of Medan was like 73, 74, 75, something like that. Next one was like 73 max. Next 72, next 70, something like that. Uh, just like just like to have an idea, you know R.I.P. electricity What the fuck was that? I thought that was the soldier who was running The power of Christ compels you Radio operator, poor radio operator, we hardly knew you, man. Did he die? I think he did. Yeah, he's dead. Kind of monster keeps... Keeps making people look weird when they're dead. Okay, wait, so if there's no captain... If there's no captain and no crew to man the ship... How does the ship arrive? How can the ship arrive? Won't it get derailed eventually? Oh, Dave. Won't you spare me over till another day? This is how I know that my character was gonna die. Starring Sean Ashmore. Because I know that the cast is supposed to be made of celebrities and I've never seen that guy before. I've never seen my my soldier guy before, so I was like, that's definitely not, definitely not where the game starts. For those who don't know, Sean Ashmore was in... What? Oh, sorry. Sean Ashmore was in Quantum Break. He was also in X-Men. He was like the frost guy. What do you, what do you also do? Oh, the boys! If anyone watched the boys, it was Lamplighter and the boys. Mm. 
Sorry about your messy game. I thought that was good, I haven't seen it. Dr. Wu! Brother! You are missing out. You need to see it. If you like... Not even if you like superhero genre, no, it's not even like, it's not even like that. It's not your typical DC or Marvel shit. No. The boys, if I had to summarize it, is basically... What would happen if you had super people like Superman and, and Batman, etc. But you made them actually human with social media and everything. You know, because humans can be evil pieces of bitch, evil pieces of shit sometimes. Evil pieces of bitches. <laughs> evil sons of bitches or evil pieces of shit sometimes. So, just because you gave them superpowers doesn't mean automatically that they're going to be the best people on earth, right? Hello. Something way more realistic. I like that music, by the way. Was that Phantom of the Opera? I think so. Or I don't remember his name. Um, so yeah, that's the premise of The Boys. And it's really fucking good. I can't highly recommend it enough. One of the most solid series in the past couple of years. Five years, like, uh, easily. I think we're on like season four now. Yeah, season. I think we're on season four now, and they've just been knocking it out of the park every season. Every season. The curator. I'm here to record the story you choose to tell. You see, this tale is only part written, and the choices you make will complete it mm -hmm. and determine whether the lives of those with whom you are interfering continue to flourish. Let's hope so. Whether they are. That's so also. I usually love to keep the people alive in these games. You see, we each make decisions according to our own moral. Compass. In the first playthrough, at least. And we have to live with those decisions or die by them. But you shouldn't fear death. It is, after all, inevitable. inevitable. It is the tax one pays for having lived, and it comes eventually to everybody. Mm -hmm. Doctor, don't you have Amazon Prime? Pretty sure, like almost everyone and their mother have an Amazon Prime. As in life, the actions you take matter. I do. So, that, there you go. It's an, it's made by Amazon. It's on Prime Video. Keeping a close eye on your. All you gotta do is start. My place to interfere, but I might be persuaded to offer the occasional hint. There are pictures in this world that can... You picked the moon yesterday? Yesterday and before yesterday, yes. If you can find them and study them, they may just help you to make better oh, decisions. Oh, that's a very good hint. Or should I say decisions... Damn, how ancient. ...outcomes you would prefer. The reason why I play to the moon is... ...will have the opportunity to... ...because... ...for all the actions that you've taken... Young. Whatever mess you've made. It's because Young recommended Severed Seal, right? He paid 80,000 channel points for Severed Seal. And I loved Severed Seal so much that I this And it was short, to be fair. It was like a short game anyways. Like, took one stream. One stream, yeah. Uh, so I was like, okay, no. I think I'm going to give him another freebie. And I chose To The Moon because that's his favorite game. According to him, that's his favorite game, so... Mm, you know, might as well try it. So it's a nice game. It's good. Not the best, but it's good. I wouldn't go as far as calling it my favorite game or anywhere near, but still, good game. So wait, what did he say about those pictures that I need to look at? How can I look at these pictures so I don't, so I make good decisions? The curator. Hmm. Mr. Curator, sir, can you help me, please? Brad. Witty Brad. Alex's brother and innocent. Okay. This is giving me... This is giving me Knives Out vibes. I don't know if you guys watched the movie. The two movies. Motivated. Alex. Brad's brother. Julia's boyfriend. Insecure. It's giving me two Knives Out vibes. Enough? Are they twins? We out, we can call for so, uh, look. No, they're not. I've this guy looks like... <laughs> he looks like a black Why? Andrew Tate, man. <laughs> what the I fuck? <laughs> Maybe 
maybe you could show me how the pros do it. I swear, I, see, I feel like I'm seeing a, a black Andrew Tate from this angle. He doesn't actually look like him. I don't think so, at least. He needs to be more bald. Insecure is embarrassing results I had to work, say nothing. Glass Onion. There's two. There's Glass Onion and the the first one. I watched both. I think both are good, but the first one was better. Both are good. That dive cam is like super expensive. Look, bro, be cool. What? Julia and Conrad are, you know, how do I say it? Super fucking loaded. So? So don't sweat the little stuff, man. It's not cool. Don't make me regret letting you tag along. Mm hmm I was invited, accusatory, uneasy, not good with people. Uh, tag along? Seriously? I thought I was invited. I was the one, one on the island, I agree. Real? Yep, I know, Julia? I remember. She wanted you to I agree, now that was much I better. To see how cool you are. Oh, wait! Oh, that, you're explaining to me. Oh, wait, I thought Knives Out was the, was the, like, the main name. And then... And then they gave other names to the other ones. I'm guessing, no, it's Knives Out is the first one, Glass Onion is the second, and there's a third one. I can't, I don't know if they named it yet. Sort of, okay. Not. I don't know if they named it or not yet. All right, amigo. Calvary's almost here. Cool. Sorry I'm a little snappy. I'm just... The new medical school would be stressful, you know? Total shocker. And man... The long distance thing. And that was so popular that they wanted to keep their brand. So Glass Onion is a Knives Out mystery. Thank you. That's it. Or something like that. Yep. Yep, exactly. And you're right. Yep, exactly. You're correct. Uh, when Knives Out came out, it was so popular. It was so good that Netflix paid... What was his name? I forgot his name. The Star Wars director that people hated. The Last Jedi director. Um... It was so good that they wanted to make sure they keep the brand for themselves. So they paid him like a shit ton of money to make the second, the sequel, and the third one exclusive to Netflix. Ryan Johnson, maybe. Maybe. It's been two weeks. Sympathetic must be tough. Sympathetic. Yeah, I got you. It must be tough. Ra Ryan Johnson, yeah. Huh? <laughs> yep. Ryan. <laughs> what? It's like, Conrad doesn't think we have enough beer. Ah. I guess I keep these in an undisclosed location. Mm -hmm. Relationship updated. How was my relationship? It went up with Alex. Yay! Truthful, envious, eager, witty, fliss. Who, who calls them? Who calls their child fliss? Is it short for Felicia or something? Please. Ryan, actually. Yep. I'm just fucking with you, man. I know. I just I just can't get over the fact that this game looks worse than Until Dawn. It doesn't look bad. It just looks worse than Until Dawn. And this came out later. It's just kind of weird. Big life choice, you know. I don't know what's the right thing to do. But again, to be fair, like you said, Doctor Wu, Until Dawn was uh, Until Dawn was really ahead of its time. If it's right. Bear, what? Was that a good idea or not? No fucking idea if that was a good idea or not. I want to look at the pictures. Let me look at the pictures. So there's character relations, and based on that, And there's also character traits. Interesting. The proposal. You'll know. Hey. This is reminding me of the fucking Attack on Titan series. The Titans. <laughs> the fuck is the smile, man? Literally reminding me of Attack on Titan. Julia, Connor's sister, Axe's girlfriend, Reckless. Hello, Sean Ashmore. Conrad, Julie's brother. Relax. Full Harley. Before I go, consider changing your camera position. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And that's because of BG3. We forgot about BG3. Cars are some of the choices. Mm-hmm. 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 There's no reason to keep it on the left side anyways. 
There's no reason to keep it on the left side. Where's the chat? Thank you for the advice, Mo. I forgot. The query has the same weird mouth stuff going on. <laughs> this is like the uncanny valley, you know? This is the uncanny valley. You think you're over it, but you go back deep inside that valley. So this is her brother, and that's her boyfriend, and that is the boyfriend's brother, correct? Just so we get this correct. Brad and Alex. My character is Brad. Alex is my brother. Alex is the girlfriend is the boyfriend of Julia, and Julia is the sister of Conrad. This is Alex. Cool. Hey, what's up, man? Right? Connie, this is Alex. Yeah, yeah. Right. There's still Fliss. <laughs> Watch it, sis. Lady killer, right here. <laughs> it's good to finally meet you, Conrad. This is Brad, by the way. My little bro. Oh, bro. Bradley! I feel like I already know you. I've heard so much about you. Yeah, uh, likewise. There's only two options, huh? Hey, man. Want to crack a cold one with me? Every second. This, I feel like they definitely didn't do uh, relax. Yeah, cool. Apprehensive. I get seasick. I feel like they definitely didn't do motion capture for this game, man. Uh, I, I love beer. What's the relationship status? I'm gonna have to keep stopping the game every second to check. Oh, we increased it. There's two bars, by the way. There's one above and one below. I don't know what's the... What's what? Right on, Bradical. I like the Bradical. Cut of your I like the cut of your shit. It's Jib. Don't ruin it. Bro. You my my guy is too socially awkward. Never. All the time. Self assured. Yeah. Totally. All the time. Nice. I feel like that was a bad idea. Oh, nope. Not noob. I feel like that was a bad idea. My character's gonna die, isn't it? Dive a couple, three times. The seedful. <laughs> okay, yeah, we're gonna die. Relaxed, excited, eager. You know, here and there, family trip. We're definitely gonna die. Brad is gone, bro. <laughs> Their heads are so small. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mean, meanwhile, you got this gig. Eh, Fliss, captain of the Duke of Milan. Courageous and patience. You got this big ass head. Okay, those are short shorts. I'd invite you to make yourselves at home, but, uh... Hey. So Fliss is... Pretty hot. Damn. That's the captain, baby. Aye, aye, ma'am. Uh, you're selling. I'm buying. Oh. <laughs> I saw that coming. I saw that coming. Hmm. Can we keep everyone alive? Let's see. I stat. Is that her bro the brother? Yeah. Get it all out. Yeah. You uh those are amazing right tats, yeah. man. You know, maybe I should. Little boy. Oh, I thought she said little boy. <laughs> Alex, look at Milan, offshore North Atlantic, of Polynesia. What about over here? That's pretty far out of the way. I'm just thinking about backup targets in case we don't find anything on the dive cam. Listen, to be honest, I've never heard of this wreck you're looking for. Usually these things are crawling with divers. Yeah. And we're going for the same... This was different. I'm just saying, if it gets... So I was right, that like boat will... Just, you know? Get derailed and sink eventually. Brad did his homework first day, but I was so sure. Brad did his homework. If he says the wreck's here, it's here. Okay, look, you're the client. I'm just saying we don't have unlimited daylight. So they're trying to investigate where the wreck was, huh? That's a great idea. Yeah, he already has a good relationship with Julia because she's she's the girlfriend. She got. 
It's updated. Impatient, motivated, eager, insecure. Bruh. The system is annoying, kinda. Because I have to check it every single decision I make. I'm gonna have to pause every single second. Calculations were right on the money. Always bet on Brad. Yeah, kid's a whiz. We should thank him. Bliss, we found a plane. Yeah. Yeah, it looks like World War II. We are ready to dive. It's a good thing I trusted Brad. Technically, we should call this in to port authorities as an unreported wreck. Well, technically. Are you sure you don't want to do this the right way? Hi, Steve. Annoyed? Who cares? Disappointed? Can't dive? Say nothing. Is saying nothing really an option? Guys, no one knows, no one cares. I chose to say no. nothing. The right way. Come on, what is this, kindergarten? I had to bring it up. If we just go down and take a look, who's gonna know? Fine. As long as you're quick. And don't touch anything. Say nothing is a valid can response. Imagine untouched? Especially when the both options are bad, in my opinion. We should be ready to get you guys in the water in a few. I'll set up the tanks. The boys will do the final checks. Take a look at the camera. See if you can find anything useful. Righto. Righto. Hey, maybe you should check on your bro. Usually. Hey. 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 Hi, sweetie. Good to go. Concern, thanks for paying. Need a hand? Need an extra hand? Never used a rebreather before. I think we're in good shape. It's probably not a bad idea for you to have a clue how these things work. Gotta say, not too happy with our captain at the moment. Sir, I'm played cool for now. Supportive, making a fortune on this trip. Seriously, where does she get off bitching about us? She's making a small fortune on this trip. Yeah, not that small. Rules are rules. I get it. But what's the big deal if nobody finds out? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. All right. The transitions are a bit yourself, weird. And then we'll go through the final steps together. Cool. Just holler at us when you're ready. Transitions are a bit weird. I think that improved my relationship with Julia. I think so. I mean, we need to stop pressing the button every time I see it over there. There's a little gap in the tail. Take a look. Wrong button. All right, trigger, right button. That's the gap. But that's not actually the boat. This is a different thing. I wonder, is that the person? I guess top bar is current size and bottom is the baseline? Maybe. It could be. Could be. That's a very good guess. That's a pretty good guess. Hi. Hi. You know, we have rules out here for a reason. You guys gotta respect that. Polite, sorry about earlier. Forceful, we paid a lot for this. Uh, yeah, sorry about that. Let's play both sides. Just... <laughs> See how it's gonna go. We've been planning this whole thing for a while now. I get it, but there are rules and laws and customs. She doesn't give. She doesn't These give me the vibe basic stuff. that she's a very a rule Dude, follower. Kind of That's sure. I have a couple of wrecks. I know it enough to know the rules. I a couple of wrecks over the years. She gi she gives me the vibes that she doesn't so care about the rules, but apparently she does care a lot about the rules. I hope the story is always the tiny head mistake. Protocol you have to follow. <laughs> I'm afraid I'm afraid that's gonna be an eternal mystery in this game. But who knows? Who's gonna know? Pompous, I get it. How much belligerent? Who's gonna know? Say nothing. You know what? I can't stop you. Just respect the rules down there. Don't do anything stupid that'll get my ass in trouble. I said nothing. Easy, see? Easy for ends. We got the we got the upgrade there. I guess you might be but wait, was Julia already this high? I guess yeah, she was uh high. What the fuck? Do you know how to use that? Uh no. 
Not really. Don't tell me that's gonna fuck. Just let it do its thing. Don't tell me I just ruined. No, I didn't do anything. Okay, good. Just turned it off and left. Hello, little bro. You okay? Wait, there's a painting there. Oh, pictures! They sell pictures! They sell pictures! This is it! That's it? Really? That's it? Wait, was there another picture that I should have found before? You need to keep out, keep an eye out for the pictures, the dark pictures anthology. Aha! It is uh, indeed the same after the title. You okay, little bro? But first, no. I'm not sure. Shroud of innocence. Is that perfume? Doux. Eau de parfum. Soft. You know it's expensive when it's just called something as simple as sweet or light. Shroud of Innocence. T.S. Hartley. Okay, let me talk to my brother first. What's up? What's up? How you doing? Sorry, that brewski got the better of me. Sympathetic stern, you should know better. Hey, all part of the adventure. Is it possible I have to be firm sometimes? Is it possible that I have to be bad ending button? <laughs> that I have to be stern or firm sometimes? In order to maybe avoid things bad, things that might happen that are bad, I don't know. There's something over here that we missed. An ID card. Qualified driving instructor, Felicity, Felicity, that's her name, Fliss is Felicity. Uh, 18, 120 pounds, brown, the instruction I find on the rear is authorized to conduct classes in the designated specialty as sanctioned by Dive Master Federation. Expires uh, December, 30, 31st of December. Was that the picture you already looked at? Yes, the boat one. It's the same one. That's why I didn't touch it again. This is the rebreather, way cooler than a regular scuba setup. It takes all that CO2 that you'd normally just exhale into the water, and instead, it gets totally reused. Then it reduces decompression time on your way up. State of the art. Cool. Okay, O2 check done. Whoa, 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 eager beaver, you gotta check your O2 first. Playful, looking good, Jay. Appreciate it. Thanks for sending me straight. Thanks for sending me straight. Okay, you little clown fishes. Feels like so far it's very straightforward. One option is bad, one option is good. Sometimes both options are bad, and then you go for say nothing. But otherwise, take, take. What do I take? What, what are those, anyways? One is the camera, and one of them is. You're on camera. I'll take the wheels. Let's get a before photo. All right, kids. <laughs> Those smiles, man. Those smiles, they're so bad. Just remember the rules, please. Take. Bearing unlocked. I accept the bank stick on the dive. Okay. So there was an option not to take the bank stick. I got the bank stick. Hey, got the bank stick. Ha, ha. Cattle produced? You yes, cattle produced. Talking about the picture, right? Just to be clear, we're talking about that picture. Is 
Game needs more music. It's awfully too quiet. The bang stick. Oh. oh. More or less. I don't even. Sh I'm not even sure what a bang stick is. What is a bang stick? Does it, does it like a, do like a flashbang or something in the water for light? Is it like those neon lights? I think it's a harpoon. Oh. It's pretty intact too. This is a fucking remarkable find. Let's swim around a little and find a way in. Where do you know how to go in using the back? Fliss. Hey, you fancy a pint with your second in command? You? Are not my second in command. Third in command. No. Fresh and eager cabin boy. Still a no. Your well paying, dashingly handsome, seafaring client is requesting the pleasure of your company over a frosty amber liquid. This is proving fast. I need to focus. Sure. I feel like she Why should not? focus, but fuck it. I might be for the reason other than a weapon. I have no idea where a bank stick is. I feel like I need to focus, but fuck it. Don't ask a lady about her money. Self assured. You know it's not polite to ask a lady about her money. Fair enough. I was just thinking about buying a boat myself, and I thought maybe you'd like to point me in the right direction. Impressive, be my pleasure. I'm interested. Sorry, I got enough on my plate. It would be my singular pleasure to help you part with your money. Uh, you know what? I better spend some time keeping the Duke of Milan ship shape. Ship shape. I think it should improve, right, Alex? Yep. So far, so good. Cool. It looks like it's basically an underwear firearm. Uh huh. So it's kind of like a harpoon, or no, firearm, as in like it actually fires things. Weather looks clear. We're not gonna turn it off. What could I use my ID for? Why? Hey there, how's it hanging? Relax, take the adventure, relax, and your time, sir, and you can monitor the dive. You look like you're taking full advantage of your relaxation time. I'm a man of many talents. Too bad charm isn't among them. So are you beached? It's too bad charm is not among them. Ah, but my charm is like a boomerang. You think it's gone right over your head until smack. You're out cold. That makes no sense. I'm not thinking I have to keep track of the dive, but apprehensive, you need to mind the speed limit. I have to keep track of the dive, but I'd be happy to continue this conversation later when I can give you my full attention. In private? Private. Just just chatting it up, you and I, in the old conversational intercourse. <laughs> cool. Very cool, Alex, my guy. Very good. Uh, Conrad, not Alex. It's Conrad. Very cool, indeed. Oh, I forgot about this button. Wow. That is not your everyday wreck. I hope those clowns don't get me in trouble. Those clowns. Duke to Alex. Duke to Julia. Rip. They're dead. They're dead. They're dead. Um, am I not allowed in there? Yes, I am. Can she touch the picture as well or no? She can't touch the picture. Does it do the same thing? Does nothing. Does nothing. Can she open the door to her room? Yes. Or is that a bathroom? What is that? 
Another picture. Is that? Why do I keep these around? Is that Edris Alba? Feels like I'm seeing Edris Alba, but I don't think it's him, no. I don't think it's him, no. Pretty sure he's not in the game. And they're gonna give me the option to steal her perfume. <laughs> the option to steal Julie's perfume. That would be a pretty meteoric fall for his acting career. A meteoric. For <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah. And he did the, the that towers movie. And he did that towers movie. <laughs> Which I believe was also called something like Dark Pick, something Dark Towers or something. How's it going? Knocked out by cold frosty. Man, I feel like such a wimp. Sympathetic, hey, it's your vacation. Hey, it's your vacation. You're allowed to overdo it. I am officially starting a temperance club. Party of one. Lifetime membership. Hope the lovebirds are having the time of their lives down there. Concerned, hope they know what they're doing. Probing, what do you know? I hope they know what they're doing down there. Attitude matters 20 meters down. Alex plays the goof, but he was pretty serious about acing his diving certification. I would like to learn diving. Curious, are you close with your brother? Surprise, what other dives? Are you close with your brother? <laughs> Known him my whole life. I would she like to learn how to dive. Around her little finger. Huh. Gotta get back up top. Check you later. FBI, open up! Raid! 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 Boom! Still haven't told the volume. Would I ever remember to lower the volume? The answer is probably no. Thank you for the raid, Terminator! Welcome in with the party of two! Welcome in, welcome in! How's it going? How are you, man? How's it going? What were you playing last? Share with us your adventures. It's going good. Glad to hear it. I'm glad to hear that. Well, hello there, Captain. Can I do something for you? I was playing I Tectonica. I don't think I've heard of it. Do tell. Maybe later, if you stay on my good side. I don't think I've heard of a nice factory building game. Oh, okay. Wait, actually, I think I may have heard of the game after all. Weather looks. Weather looks clear. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. What's that about? Pirates? Uneasy, that's not the Coast Guard. Dismiss a fishing boat from the looks of it. That is not the Coast Guard. So we're not under arrest. But that doesn't that mean... That doesn't mean things are confident. Be quiet, let me handle it where this feels off. Uh, we are not doing anything. Relaxed, innocent, motivated, excited, witty. I'm the captain. Wow, the relationship with Conrad boosted. Be quiet and let me handle it. You got that? Really boosted that. What the fuck? <laughs> get out of here, worried. We've got the divers in the water. Hey, get out of here! What do you think you're doing? The fuck was that? Thank you for the alert. Are they blind? Are they blind? Look at our boat! We can take care of this man, it's not a problem. What do you think? Like uh ten bucks cover it? Oh, whoops, my bad. Let's make it twenty. Well shoot, you you think it's more like thirty? I can do thirty. What the fuck are you doing? The fuck are you doing, you fucking idiot? Bargain, but I'm with you. Here. Let's just throw in the whole pot. Bro, Conrad is such a fucking idiot, let me just say that. Conrad, and that's the guy we saw. Uh, the guy who I thought was Edris Elba. That's the guy with the gun. <laughs> definitely, definitely not Edris Elba. Definitely not Edris Elba. If he wasn't gonna kill you before, he should. Yep, yep. 
Conrad sealed his fate, bro. He sealed his fate. There's no saving him. But hey, let's just hope his aim is as good as his driving. Alright. Let's just say hope the fucking aim is as good as the driving. Because holy shit was he bad, bro. He just hit my sh he hit my ship, my ship stationary ship. And he's like, hey, you ruined my ship. Sure. <laughs> what the fuck? Try driving better next time. Oh my god, I was... I was not uh, paying attention there. I was not paying attention there. That was a last second save. <coughs> that was a last second save. Can I just take a second to save? Thanks, take it was more probable version of speed gun. Ooh. I mean, can you believe it? It's a dream come true. <laughs> Let's not waste any time not exploring. Go, go, go. Is that? Julia, leave it. You don't have to take your gear off to get in there. Not worth it. That pipe's pretty tight. What if you get stuck without your rebreather? Flippant, live a little. Concerned, maybe it's kind of dangerous. Maybe it is kind of dangerous. I don't know, man. Seems like she can fit in there. She can't fit in there. We can't save, right? There's no option to save and go back and do shit. Yep, there's no option to save. No saves coming here. Should we? self is equal generous. Alright, Dr. Wu. Say no more. Say no more. I'm just gonna go for it. Say no more, fam. Wait, he came back. He came back. He teleported back. It's her character traits. No, 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 say no more. It's on you. If she dies, it's on you, brother. It's on you. Remember. Does it go? Yeah, I knew it was going down. I know it was going to go down. 100% I knew. Witty, generous, excited, selfish. She just... Uh, it's an octopus. An octopus is okay. Reminds me of the Mind Flayers. Okay, I wouldn't go if, the, if I knew if I knew it was that deep. Had I known it was that deep, I would not have went inside. I would have not have went inside. Jenny, excited, bored, smart, dumb, rich, poor. <laughs> All good. All good. You got something stupid down here? That's it. One chance, you get that. Defiant, non challenged, I was fine. I know what I was doing, okay? Say nothing. Just glad you're okay. Don't do that again, please. You're gonna give me a heart attack. Aww. Searching in progress. Search that wasn't even worth it. That wasn't even worth it. Launch from a US base. Kowalski. I don't know if this is worth it, but this oh, side is not. Way to help out a ship. We ruined our relationship with Alex, man. Look, it, it went under the baseline now just because of one, one simple and stupid reason. Secret found. Cool. I just got you the good oh, ending. Yeah. You just got me the worst ending possible, bro. The relationship is over. Literally. The relationship is over. Check it out. Check it out. We configure the bomb rack to hold lifeboats. Interesting. Is there something I could possibly find? I guess not. One of the rescue boats is missing. Ah, it was. That was a secret. Think they were using it? Let's see what else we can find. No, that's the same thing.
Good God. Uh, I think he's wet. From all these years of being underwater. Ugh. Wait. Ugh. Who, who does the decomposition underwater? Are there like creatures or insects or whatever underwater that do the decomposition? Is there something like oh, that? They knew they were goners. The same thing? Up. Same thing. You get curious to know what is there. Did you hear that? Let's check it out. Nice. Should I use the blank stick to open the door of the cockpit? Were we not supposed to use the bank stick? To open the door to the cockpit? Is that a gun? It is a gun, isn't it? He's got a gun! <laughs> nice, uh... Nice jump scare. Like the, 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 that fish was faster than the flash, man. The way it came, it was faster than the flash. Plane crash not high on my list of ways to perish. He killed himself, uh huh. I see. He shot himself in the head before he died. Easy now. This stuff's been down here a long time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't want to do that. Just don't touch anything else, please. I legit did not want to do that. There's definitely something inside else to explore. Eric's knife was not used on the dive. We gotta get out of here now. We're already out of here. I feel like I already fucked up by doing that thing, man. Not interested in us. Let's go. There was there's still stuff to explore though. No. Uh, oh, okay. Thought this was the right time, but then didn't know if it was the right time. Is he proposing now? Right yeah, he's proposing now, isn't he? Yes. He's definitely proposing right now. I know you can't tell because we're underwater, but I'm on my knees right now. Uh-huh. Julia. Will you marry me? Well, that's definitely astounding. We almost died just because you're hitting, you're shooting me, right? Say nothing. I, I, oh crap! This is definitely not I, the right time. I, I'm not sorry. the right time at all. I mean, we almost just died. Julia, I'm serious. What do you mean? Loving? Yes. Shocked? Any time to think about this? No, no, definitely yes. Wow. What a god. Very updated. Julia said yes. How's it end? Yes! Yes! I'll marry the shit out of you! How, how, how good... How good is it gonna... Did you see that? It raised... It barely raised up a, a centimeter. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? She said yes, and then we got the bends and died. Mm -hmm. And then the shark came back to fuck with us. Okay, no, actually it did raise, but just doesn't show immediately how much it's going to raise or... This is Julia. We're coming back up. Over. They're too busy fighting the ship. Well, it's gone. Hey, that other boat come from? You just saw that other boat? Wait, Julia. We gotta decompress here. I was gonna oh, say. I was gonna say, how do they know that, that the boat didn't already do the damage? Right, and my brother's up there. Damn it, yeah, okay, cautious. Yeah, okay. What happens if you don't do compress? Do they blow up or something? Can they blow up or something? 
And in fact, I'm going locked in this is taking too long. So you say nothing. You, can, you get sick and could die. Oh. I don't know. What's wrong with their faces? Cool man, everything's all right now. Was that just the barbecue? There was a little uh, mishap with the barbecue. Jesus, look! Like I'm so thing. happy I ignored it. And she's what's, what's with the other boat? Where? Why are you paying the ocean? So why are you paying the ocean? A group of fishermen came by and damaged their boat. Well, they got caught on the dive line. Oh, that's what happened. Yeah. So then uh, Ambassador Conrad figured the best move is to show him he'd rather throw away his money than give it to them. You're an asshole. Whatever. Who cares, right? What I want to know is, what'd you guys find? Well, we found the plane. And it is huge. Full of cool stuff. Oh my god, you guys. Can you all just shut up for like one second? Holy shit! Bearing updated. Alex and Julian are still in game with the others. Dude, bro, congrats! Nicely done. Come up and let. I'm pretty sure there was other stuff on that boat, but it's too late now. It's too late. I I wanted to stop rearing that thing back, but couldn't. You're getting to know these intrepid adventurers then. Alex and his little brother Brad trying to swim with the big fish. Both seem out of their depth. And Julia, the love of Alex's life. And he, the love of hers. I wonder if he, says, if he would have said something else if, uh, if he rejected the Maybe proposal. Maybe you'd say arrogant. And then there's Captain Fliss, strong, Forthright, stubborn. Do I detect a spark between her and Conrad? Perhaps. Let me reassure you. Special feature unlock. You help them to make some decisions they'll value later on. Ooh. You're doing well. Fair man, Jakes. Claps every all around. I'm doing well, we're doing well. The guy in the game told me I'm doing well. 10 out of 10. <laughs> How do I know? What's the special feature thing? What's the special feature thing? If you surface too quickly while scuba diving, it basically does to your body what happens when you shake up and open a carbonated soda. Oh. Which is, what happens? Ah, it blows up. Your lungs collapse. Okay. Okay, so it was definitely a good idea not to resurface quickly. Definitely. Because of change in pressure. Mm-hmm. So, we're like 10 seconds out of the jaws of certain death. Well, certain, I mean... You get bubbles in your veins and uh, other places you're not supposed to probably stoke out and have a heart attack. Or have a heart attack. Well, needless to say, this lady... Amazing. Well played there, man, no? Wasn't Comrade going to get us some more beers after he helped Fliss? Maybe he decided, hey, I'll drink some, and then he got drunk. And, so and he then those who are uh, doing uh, drinking, and he drank all the business. It. Sounds like you've had some experience with this kind of phenomenon. Yeah, I've been studying it for you. I'll go look for him. But hey, that's very helpful uh, advice. Thanks, guys, for pointing that out. I had no idea. I don't think I, I, I remember something like this. But then again, if I'm gonna go diving, I'm pretty sure the instructor is gonna tell us. Check Mythbuster and putting diving suit full of pig meat. What did he say? I'll stick with my own name. Cheerful. It does have a nice ring. Honestly, I wasn't sure how it would feel, but now that I hear it, it does have a nice ring. So I will check it out. I guess we should talk about wedding plans. Eventually. Sentimental, let's find to get the provocative. Dad can foot the bill. Now you're speaking my language. Been taking lessons. Yeah, I can't wait for us to plan everything. Bro, the teeth are so weird, man. How can they fuck him up that badly? Reassuring, I agree. He doesn't sure how to respond. Of course, I was gonna say yes, you dimwit. 
I'm happy you did. The second you said yes, I could see our whole future rolling out ahead of us. Doreen, faithful. So you can walk all over me? I love you, Alex. I wanted to go for that playful thing, but like... My guide won't take it. Depression here. Is ready to dissolve gases in the blood. When they talked about it later, they were both happy. Things are going smoothly. Is it just me or are things too smooth? Look at that bump. Nitrogen poisoning. Decompression here is ready to dissolve gases in the blood. I'll go find them. Ah, okay. Hey, you seen my brother? Or Fliss? What do you think they're doing? No, Take a guess. Got distracted. How did you get distracted? You're literally on a boat in the middle of nowhere. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Jesus Christ, going out mischief as the Coast Gods are here. Say nothing. Say nothing! Why would you ruin that? Why would you ruin I'm that? Sorry to interrupt your seven seconds in heaven. Oh, oh good yeah, God. Beers. Send it to you on Discord. Deal. And my boy Conrad does not wait. He acts fast. <laughs> Just met her and he fell in love. And Miss Baltas video is a good way to make sure you never want to go scuba diving. <laughs> no, no, I, I will. I'll still right. go. Now I'll still go. Here. Let's take a look at the navigator's pad we found. Maybe we can figure out why the plane was out here. Where'd you put it? It's in your case. Okay, I'll go get it. Hey. Wait. So, how's it feel to be a man's post proposal? Relieving, honestly. That's it? And do anything else with it? Why did they make me carry it then? Ten eighty P waterproof thirty meters. Mm-hmm. Never thought you were the settling type. Proud of you, bro. I couldn't have done it without such a good bro, bro. Bro. Bro, bro. Wait, what do you mean? You told me to follow my heart. One, I'm not that savvy. Can't believe you followed this route between Fliss and that rich prick. Chose romantic, bro. <laughs> what do you mean? Why? It's Sean Ashmore, brother. It's Sean Ashmore. I like Sean Ashmore. He's a nice guy. I was annoying what happened to the people in the Titan. In the Titanic, you mean? So no mission to recover the bodies. Also, also, if anything, it's going to be a mission to recover their wallets. Yep. Yep. Um, also, Mo, the point is, I think by c establishing a connection between these two, they might live later on. His guy needs an axe at the head. <laughs> Maybe. But two is better than one when it comes to survival. We need to ensure the survival. We going again tomorrow. Need to ensure the survival, bro. Stop walking back and forth like an idiot. Yeah, seems a little too dangerous for my blood. What's the weather? The weather is good. I'm gonna go find Julia. Wow, I'm right here, bro. Hey, almost time for barbecuing. Got the pad yet? Sorry, I got distracted. No worries. Let's go get it. No, Titan is a submarine full of billionaires going to... Ah, you meant that thing. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Was it an Xbox controller or something else? Could have been friendly without making a cheese fest. How is CS2 young? Amazing. Hate that most commands don't work. F. Got it. Let's go up. I don't think it would have been possible, brother. I don't think it would have been possible. I think they want... We should get back. I think they want there to be romance between them. Right here. What was that? A button. Prompt. <laughs> You'll get no resistance there. Alright, everyone. Check it out. Manchurian gold. Who wants to find some sunken treasure? So what do you think, Captain? Coordinates? Those are coordinates, all right. Maybe the plane's destination? You what? Rank is per map? It takes a couple hours if the weather stays steady. That's weird. Did you find anything else? 
There was a flight plan on board that seemed to indicate it was a rescue plane. Yeah, that makes sense. After the war, they turned long-range bombers into rescue planes. And then the I didn't. must have been shot down because it was riddled with bullet holes. I found one lodged in the fuselage. Huh. And That's so weird. Must have gotten shot down before they could Why? all the rafts. There was only one missing. Reckless, all of you. Excuse me? I told you to leave everything down there alone. Oh, come on. We've been Completely alone. alone. That's too much of a spectacle. No, hey. They were respectful. No, you did whatever you wanted. Whatever you took, it was too much. As if nobody knows apologizing, okay, maybe. You're right. We should have been more careful. That's not me, I'm sorry. Okay, maybe. I don't know you. You should have never gone down to that plane in the first place. It's bad luck. You think you can scavenge down there and it makes no difference, but every single thing you bring back has an essence. It's like a ghost you invite to the surface. Here we go. Huh. I never thought about it like that. You never think about much of anything. Well, maybe I never heard about such cool ghost stories. They're not cool ghost stories. Not like for fun. People drown in these waters and you have to respect their resting place. Damn straight. Fred, you got a fun ghost story, right? What the yeah. fuck, man? Uh, Why is Fliss so yeah, aggressive? Right here, Jesus. Let's hear it. We could all use a good show. Boy, let's hear it. Skeptical, I don't know. Let's hear it. I bet you can spin a good yarn. It's kind of messed up, actually. Uh. Scare away, little bro. Okay. Here goes. This story is true. It had happened right near here. In an old lighthouse. Classic setup. Wait, true story? Where'd you hear this? If you need to know, it's ripped right from the rotting pages of the terrifying ancient in-flight magazine I was perusing on our way here. Uh-huh. The lighthouse stood atop an atoll, isolated. Hello, Senderito. I'm always still breathing. Good to know. See, I still had to. But it's something you, keeping you grounded. Half-Life 3 is a real more ground. Half-Life 3 is the... A game breaker, bro. The game changer. She's stumbling down the street. Half Life 3. He hurries to her aid and she falls into his arms, sobbing. As he hurries her back to the lighthouse, he asks where she's from. He doesn't waste any time. Smooth. Amused, one track mind. He of the one track mind. The woman answers I live here, in the lighthouse. My parents are upstairs right now. Twists. Of course, the lighthouse keeper says, That isn't so. Of course, he's lived there alone for years. And the woman becomes hysterical, and his sister parents are upstairs. So, they go to the top of the lighthouse, and there, splayed out on the floor, is a man and a woman brutally murdered with an axe. Always an axe. I mean, do people even use axes anymore? Yeah. Just reporting the facts, cliches and all. Chopped up into little tiny giblets. Giblets. So gross, we should embellish the facts. Sometimes you have to embellish the facts a little to get at the deeper truth. It's okay. It's okay. Okay. So. Okay. Who did it? So the woman, she's still hysterical, says her husband did it, and he's still here, in the closet. Ooh. Huh. The husband, eh? So is this a warning to all future brides? Hey, no backseas. You're locked in. So the lighthouse keeper creeps over to the closet, opens the door. And sure enough, there's a man inside. Okay. But he's cut his own throat. Horrified. You need to tell me what happened sooner. I'm gonna beat your ass when I see you. So never next month trust him at your doorstep. I only care about the brothers. The what now? He looks closer. The two white characters are beyond obnoxious. Closer. He's talking about the game. Closer. And he sees. I I don't. It's his own Fliss was cool too. Fliss is not cool so far. And I don't mind the white. I don't mind the white characters. Good one, by the way. I don't mind the white characters. Nice one, Squire. And also, they do have some cheesy lines. I don't like disagree. I don't disagree. Okay, you But that's fine so far. We should all turn in. There's some. It's fine. Ooh, Brad got happy with us. No, 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 because according to standard vessel regulation, we're all required one more beer before hitting the hay. What regulations are these? <laughs> uh, it's standard issue regulatory institutional protocol subdivision 1099. Uh-huh. 
1069 joke. The internet. Oh, so you found a website that tells you to drink beer under every circumstance. I'm just following orders, man. <laughs> I'm into this website. <laughs> and for good buddy. And I'm out. El Bozo. All right. It's 12 a.m. I think. Actually, we started at 10.30. We can play a bit more. Karna has such a punchable face. Bro, what do you mean? That's Sean Ashmore. Shut up. Shut up. Shut your mouth, Mo. He's a cool guy. He's a cool and he's a good actor. He's in a, he's playing an annoying character here, but still. What? What was that? Was that the three fishermen? That's definitely the three fishermen. Oh, 100% that's the three fishermen. Bro, I had my hand off. I had my fucking hand off the controller for a second. What? We we nailed both of those to, to get fucked anyways? We nailed both of those, man. I have no idea who that is. Who, what is? Ah, Sean Ashmore. You haven't watched X-Men, the old ones? Or uh, The Boys? Or Quantum Break? Or, I don't know. Yep. Hello, Mr. Fisherman, sir. What a big surprise. Why wouldn't you lock the door on your boat or yacht or whatever? Shouldn't you lock your door? Ungag, ungag. Why did? Why are they giving me a choice between him and her? Why not give me the choice for both of them? Yes, no, no. Well, if you know. If you know X-Men, then... Uh, he's the frosty boy. He's the frosty guy. The ice guy. He was the ice guy. The one who dated Jean... Not Jean Grey. What was the, the other girl? The one who zaps your energy or something? Yeah, he's he's the ice guy. The fire guy was the uh, another actor. You okay? I think so. Oh, that's the, the that's the b bottle I hit him with. Cool forehead, bro. Cool forehead. That doesn't look good. What happened to Brad? Where's Brad? Where's Brad and all this? These are kind of maybe the fishermen I pissed off earlier. Oh god damn it, Conrad. Great, just great. I told you. Told you it's all his fault. Nice. Told you it's all his fault. We're gonna ask the good news first. Ah, I like the first guy. I know, right? See? But yeah, true, he is punchable here. He is, he has an annoying character here. Or rather an obnoxious one. But... They would have done it already. I'm not just worried about being killed. Anti. Ooh. Nice try. Does he forget about me? <laughs> After missing a punch, does he forget about me? Nobody knows you're out here, little lady. You're all alone with us now. What? What's with the accent? You can go fuck yourself, you piece of shit. You're the little lady. The little lady. Why can't, why can't I dodge that? I 
And that. And that one as well. He already has a red eye, Jesus. Flippant, you know how to treat a lady. Serious, what do you want? Oh, yeah. You know how to treat a lady, right? <laughs> I knew that was gonna get. See, Mo, I, I fulfilled your thing. I fulfilled your, your, your want. <laughs> I knew my choice was gonna get a punch. So I chose it, anyways. There you go. Free punch. Free punch on the house. Stop! Please just stop. Slow down. Easy. Danny. They just stop. Antagonistic. Fuck you. Mm, say nothing. Reckless, generous, wary, relaxed, compassionate, foolhardy. Okay. What are they doing? What's the point? And where's Brad? Again, where's Brad? Get off of me. Say nothing. Sometimes saying nothing is the best option. Uh, maybe I should have said something. Maybe I should have said something to distract him. Or oh, never mind, it's the same. How did he get the red eyes so quickly then? Wait, wait, no! Alex! Stop it, let her go! Bruh. Bruh. Hey. Just... Lipstick. Shut the fuck up. They're just gonna pretend that he doesn't have the I ties on again? Here. They have an Iflis. Iflis sure seems to be getting buddy buddy with him. Did you see my brother? Nope, but I'm just saying for an hour now. Nope, I'm sure he's fine. Uneasy. Nope, I hope he's okay. No, but I'm, I'm sure he's fine. These guys probably just want money or something. All right, come around. I don't see how the traits play a role in all of this. I'm not sure what they do in all of this. We get Julia back. Maybe we could take him by surprise. Okay, they're coming. <sighs> Fuck, motherfuckers! Why don't you try ambushing them? Oh shit! The fisherman took his head. No! It's okay. It's okay. Not the ring! Not the wedding ring! Oh no! Just have to wait and see what they want to do with us. That was a bit anticlimactic. Not gonna lie. There wasn't really lots of. Uh, Big options there. Five, six, seven, eight. Eight seconds. Storm's eight miles away. They came here on a boat. Maybe we can take it. And where's Brad? Again, for the love of God, where's Brad? The main guy here. And he's got a gun. If we play our cards right, we can catch him. My, my guy's just chilling in his boxes, huh? <laughs> Confident. Concerned, I can sneak around to the boat. Confident. We should just rush him. 
Take the gun. They can try to fight back, but if we had the gun, they'd be forced to surrender. Seven seconds. I can get out through the window. We gotta break these off first. It's too loud. They'll hear it. But we're gonna break them during the thunder. <sighs> Good call. I climb out the window. Can you time it? The side and hit them from there. Can you actually the time the, the, the breaking of the window with thunder sound? Okay. okay, let's do it. Can you? Hello. What? What the fuck? What the fuck? They literally said one, two, three. The other side. We'll hit them together. The fuck was that? Pretty sure there's gonna be a quick time event here. Grab knife, escape. Gra escape? You kidding me, right? Escape. Imagine if Kami just. I'm pretty sure Fliss has something. I got this. I think I think Fliss backstabbed us or something. Danny brought Alex on a deck with a knife to his throat. Let's see, old-fashioned Mexican standoff. Old-fashioned Mexican standoff. Where's Brad? Jake. That, really? That's it? That's how he took it? That's how he took the gun? That's how he took the gun? That's the... Okay, fine. Fine. Again, anti-climatic way of handling things. Take his French for flop on the ground. Literally, take his French for flop on the ground. Literally, bro. What the fuck was that? Where's Brad? Stop! Arrête! <laughs> I understood that at least. Definitely understood that. Olsen! Come here! Imagine if the, all this time Brad is just hiding somewhere. Which one of you is gonna tell me about this? Manchurian gold. Manchurian gold. Imagine if all this time Brad is just chilling somewhere, hiding. And and the fact that Conrad has the option to escape and leave them is insane. I wonder if he's actually successful in that attempt. Fles, Duke of Milan. Are we gonna seduce him to take the gun? My guess is he gets shot trying to start the engine. Who? Oh, Conrad? Yeah, I guess you're right. I guess you might be right. Legend layoff, reassuring, we're only we're, we're only talking. There is no harm in just talking. You wanna talk? Keep the volume down. I'm just gonna say it. Bliss has gotta be in on this. She and these guys, they travel in the same waters. Mm-hmm. Interesting. They barely laid a hand on her. I bet you told them about. They barely, they barely laid a, laid a hand on your girlfriend, bro, or your fiance. This trot. Say nothing. You're all in this together. This was a trap, and you set us up. Because the trot makes makes my character feel bad. This thought makes my character feel bad. See, exactly. I'm still relaxed, innocent, excited, motivated. But the other one makes him... 
pisses him off, basically. Sit still. Follow you. You, come with me. Hey, leave her alone. Oh. Find out how long the storm is gonna last. Can you try anything? Anything fishy. And they <laughs> we don't want to try anything fishy with the fisherman, don't we? <laughs> Probably not the best of ideas. Duke of Milan requesting weather update. Over. Duke, we read you. Everything okay? Over. Defiant. That's what. I'll, how bad's the storm? Compliant. Say nothing. You're gonna play it that way. I said nothing. I said nothing! I said nothing! No. Jesus. So how come I went flying but he didn't go flying? It's like that he's not even asking you about that, but okay. Help, hold on. Hey! Move it! Now! There's something weird. Something weird. I don't know where he is. There's something weird. Can't put my finger on it. The other punch is he might drown. Okay, keep a lid on it. It could be our ticket out. Brad stays hidden. Better off down there than with these psychos. Oh yeah, great. He could get killed down there. He's literally shouting. Brad's a big boy. He'll be okay. And it's probably better for us if he stays put for now. They're literally shouting about it. They understand English, he's right there. Uh, hello? Is this the murder ship? The ghost murder ship? Yep, that's definitely the ghost murder ship. That guy, that's the guy who jumped and broke his neck. R.I.P. Duke of Milan About to become Duke of the Bottom Sea Everyone's still alive Things could have been quite different Mm-hmm, mm-hmm Am I gonna get like help or something? Kind hearted creature I am, I'd like to offer you some forewarning of what's to come. Tempted? Yes. Curious forewarned is forearmed. What will be will be. <laughs> okay then. We will turn to the bard for inspiration. The Merchant of Venice, Act 2, Scene 7. It's just a prank hand. Pulls a scroll just a prank, bro. Skull and reads, All that glisters is not gold. Often have you heard that told. Anyway, now that you've reached a point of significant distress, I presume you're eager to get back to your story. But here's Does that mean... Everything... May not be an exactly as it seems. Does that mean that something special feature? What's the special features? I haven't seen them. Probably shouldn't have said that. Does that mean that things that are helpful are not actually helpful? I don't know. There's a there's a there's a betrayer among us, isn't there? 
Seems like, or maybe this is just for the, the for the gas stuff. Or maybe this is just for the gas stuff. That's not true. I wonder. What was it really is the other side? <laughs> Imagine. For the love of God, where is bread? What happened to my boy? What happened to Mer? What happened to my boy? Jesus. Uh, nope, no thanks. So the World War II freighter just kept floating in the sea and no one actually found it ever? Is that possible? God, keep moving. Am I playing as Conrad? Yes. Ship is huge. Indeed, it is. The fuck was that, bro? That seems possible. Indeed. It's like a, she said it, but it's a floating death trap, basically. She said it. I love the fact that Junior still... Junior still has his bloody forehead. He never bothered cleaning. Even though he's literally in the middle of the sea. Just... Eternal bloody head forehead. Hello. Stay back. Stay back. Bro, I'm trying to go into the fucking thing. I did not sign up for a trip to Creek Town. Something about this place is making my hair stick up so far it's gonna jump out of my neck. The Mask of Madness. If you understood French, maybe you understand. Oh shit! Oh shit, a rat, no. What's a rat? Wait, there's something there. Internal memorandum. Private O'Neill. You're recovering Patterson's guard duty tomorrow. He is again. He is sick again. First is 2400. Check the chart for rotation. Again, this is the third time this week. None of us like it down there. Maybe Thatcher should buck up. Just get on it. He just took it? Okay, cool. Yeah, port ici. Des dons. Cool. 
think that still has kerosene in it? These. What the hell is this fucking place? An abandoned ship. These maid heads seem spooked. Given our observations that this is some sort of ship and seems to be abandoned, I'm gonna go out on a limb and say it's some sort of abandoned ship. Do <sighs> you think this ship is the Manchurian goal? No. We are in the vicinity of those coordinates. We can't just sit around. We need a plan. We're not exactly in the best position to be making any moves. The second they let their guard down, we gotta take advantage of it and get off the ship. It's dangerous here, so do them hurt too bad. Yeah, man. This whole rust bucket's one tetanus shot from the bottom of the ocean. We already tried to escape. Didn't exactly work out. We gotta get back to the boat and find Brad. What happened to him? No idea. They swiped our distributor. It's a very good question. It's gonna be difficult to get anywhere without it. Hot wired. So can't we just, like, hot wire or something? You cannot hot wire distributor cap. Okay, these assholes knew exactly what they were doing. While those guys are out panning for Manchurian gold or whatever they think they're gonna find on this floating coffin, we gotta take advantage and look. Uh, decreased because I what I said. Fliss. I should have I been curious. That, um, I might have gotten things kind of wrong back there. Uh, excuse me. I may have kind of. What do you mean, excuse me? You know what he's talking about. Come to the conclusion that maybe... You know what you he's know, talking about. You were literally being accused in front of your face. Whatever. But I... I mean, obviously that's not true. They're being just as bad to you as they are to us. So... Yeah. That's character oh, development. He's saying that he's sorry. Well, I... Hmm. Well, your apology is kinda accepted. Cool. Cool. All right, uh, there's a picture there. There's a picture, but I want to save. How can I save? Does the game automatically save? I think we're done for today. It's it's time. I'm guessing the game automatically saves. I hope I didn't miss all these pictures. Because it seems strange that that's how they're placed. So, all right, Dark Pictures Anthology, Man of Medan, not the best supermassive game. Did he say piss black? Yes. Um, not the best supermassive game. Also true, but so far so good. I'm 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 curious to see how this ends. I'm curious to see how this ends. It's not the best, that's for sure. But like I said. I'm curious to see how it ends. So, tomorrow. Tomorrow we'll get that opportunity. The hysterical uh, playing the fool. Interview with Sean Ashmore. Watch a short documentary on the history of the Antarctic horror stories. Unlock by completing the scene open deck. Unlock by collecting all 25 brass secrets. All 50 secrets. I think we're kind of like halfway. Or maybe less than halfway. But close to that amount done with the game all righty then fellows thank you for joining appreciate you all 44 4.5 hours according to how long to beat oh 4.5 hours and that's definitely that's definitely half of the game that's definitely half of the game have a good one y'all have a great night thank you dr wu have a great friday enjoy it we'll continue tomorrow as always peace bye bye